Hey guys and welcome to my channel. My name is Karen and welcome to Our Irish Family. So today I want to go through some of my personal and YouTube and blog goals um, for 2018. But first of all, I just want to say a happy new year to everybody. I hope you had a great 2017. 2017 for us on a personal level was good. Nothing um, bad happened to us thankfully. Um, we got to go on holiday to Disney World for two weeks um, and that was really good. It's just nice to go on a holiday throughout the year because it just gives you like something to look forward to. Um, we don't have anything planned for 2018 as of yet but it's still the start of the year. Something could crop up for us. Um, but yeah, overall 2017 was a good year. Nothing bad happened um, and it was just just a good year. It was great seeing Ava grow up. I got to stay home. Obviously the majority of the year or all of the year were her um, and I loved it. I loved being able to see her grow, catch her first steps, her first words, like all that sort of stuff, you know. So I really, really enjoyed that. I had the opportunity to further my YouTube channel, start a blog, um, interact with everybody on social media. So for me, 2017 was good. Um, but in 2017, on the 1st of January, 2017, I put up a video sharing with you my goals for the year. And I'm just gonna do a, a very quick recap on that. I have it all wrote down. Um, so for me, I started the 1st of January, 2017, I started with 2,095 subscribers on my YouTube channel. And my goal for the year was to have 3,500 subscribers. And I whooped, I kicked butt on that one. And I ended 2017 on 5,970 subscribers. So I gained realistically about 4,000 subscribers this year. And I am so, so happy. So I thank you so, so much for subscribing to my channel, for watching my videos and that sort of stuff. I really, really appreciate it. And I'm looking forward to interacting with you guys a lot more this year. And um, also one of my goals for 2017 was to increase my videos. So I was doing two videos per week and I wanted to increase it to three videos per week. I did that and then I also then increased it for the second part of the year to four videos per week. Um, so I definitely knocked that goal out of the bar, out of the ballpark. Um, and then I also wanted to complete six collabs and that is with individual channels and I definitely completed that. I'm not quite sure of the number but I definitely have done more than six. Um, so I have my 2018 goals split into personal ones for myself, ones for Ava and then ones for the business which is YouTube and blog. So my personal ones, the first one is going to be I want to learn a language. Many, many moons ago, I bought a um, Rosetta Stone learn how to speak French thing. And I started it and then I stopped. But this year, I just want to take some time, maybe like an hour or two per month, just to kind of learn um, a little bit of French. Um, and yeah, that was that's my first goal for myself is to learn a language. Um, my second goal is um, to read more meaningful books. And what I mean about that is currently I read a book a day. Um, on my Kindle, I'm obsessed with reading. It's just my favorite hobby. Um, and I have Kindle Unlimited. And if you're interested in that, I will leave the link to Amazon to find out what Kindle Unlimited is. It's basically this service where you pay a monthly fee and you can read as many books in that Kindle Kindle Unlimited category as you want. And I was just kind of reading romance books. Um, and so I like kind of read romance, teen and young adult books is really what I read. But this, this year I want to set myself a goal where at least three of the books I read per month need to be meaningful. And what I mean by meaningful is they need to be like a financial based book, um, self development books, um, leadership books, motivation books, those sorts of things um, that are get my mind working a little bit more and maybe in the long run I might be able to like improve 
some of the things we do here at home, some of the things I do myself, and um, some of the things with my YouTube and blog, I might be able to improve those things um, by reading these meaningful books. Um, so if you have any suggestions on like leadership, motivation, financial, self-development type of books, please do leave them below and I will definitely be checking lots of books out throughout the year and on my blog I'm going to be doing a monthly blog post to let you know what books I've read and whether I recommend them or if I've gained any information from them. Um, so make sure that you are subscribed to my blog or you are subscribed to like my Facebook um, because I will post up there when I have a new blog post. But um, the third thing is I want to be more active. So I now have a Fitbit um, and I have put up on my Facebook and Instagram how you can connect with me on my Fitbit. But basically I'll have it linked below my public profile and I'll also have the email. So if you add me as a friend, um, I can add you to the challenges that I have set up. So there's like a work week challenge, which is Monday to Friday, and a weekend challenge, which is obviously Saturday and Sunday. And basically you just challenge against the ladies and men in that group. Um, and it's just like first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth. And it's really up to yourself whether you want to walk or you don't. We're not a highly competitive group. Um, I have my steps goal to be 8,000 steps per day because right now I'm not even doing 8,000 steps. So my, my goal for the year is to do five out of seven days to reach my steps goal for the day, which is 8,000. And basically that's just me going for a walk, um, going up town for a walk, like that sort of stuff. So I just kind of want to be more active. I'm not going to try to set myself a, a, a to lose weight because that never works for me. But I do want to utilize this Fitbit, challenge myself against you. If you have a Fitbit, definitely add me. I'll have my email that you can add me on the app or if you want to send me a message or leave your email down below, I will add you and then I'll delete that comment um, if you don't want your email to be on my YouTube comments. Um, so definitely check out my profile, send me an email or you send me a message with your email and I'll add you to the, the Fitbit groups that I have going. So on to Ava's goals that I have set myself for her. Um, basically the first one, two easy, hopefully enough ones, is to reduce her TV or screen time. I know for a fact that she watches way, way, way too much TV. She relies on watching TV and recently she has noticed that she can watch stuff on my phone. Um, so I want to cut that back. Um, and I um, don't really have a strategy right now. I kind of, we've been doing it for the past couple of days where we've be, not been letting her watch TV and not giving her our phone and making her play with her toys. Um, it's going pretty well. Um, obviously there is slip ups and we do give her the phone for stuff. Um, but yeah, basically reduce her TV time. And then the second goal I have for myself, for Ava, is to introduce one to two new foods for her per month. She is an awful fussy eater. Um, she barely eats any food at all. Pasta and toast are what she lives on. Um, so I want to introduce to her some foods. Again, I'll just pick one or, food, one or two foods per month and give it to her two to three times per week. Um, and see if she likes it. If she doesn't like it after a month, she's not going to like it, you know, if she's having it two to three times per week. And um, so that is my goals for Ava. And now onto my YouTube and blog goals, AKA the business. <laughs> um, so as I've mentioned before, um, when you watch the ads before my channel, that enables me to get paid. It's a very, very small amount. It's like less than a cent every time you watch an ad. Um, but basically, you know, YouTube is a hobby, but it also is turning into like a job for me, you know. Um, brands are currently reaching out to me about various stuff. Most of them I don't take on because it's not something that I want um, to share with my subscribers and it's not something I think is beneficial for you guys that are watching. So I kind of ignore half of the brands that approach me. Um, and obviously when brands approach you, there is money exchanged. Um, but again, as I said, I'm not going to be sharing items or products with you guys if I don't think that is, is useful and I don't, I haven't researched it thoroughly, you know, because I'm not just going to, if somebody approaches me with, I don't know, like 
a gun. I'm hardly going to like advertise that for them because it's not applicable to my channel and I wouldn't use it. And it's illegal here in Ireland, but you know, you get what I mean. But on to the goals. So my goals, as I said, I started this year, the 1st of January, 20. 18 and um, I started with 5,970 subscribers and my goal is to double that so basically I'm going to round it up I want to reach 12,000 subscribers by the end of the year um, so if you're not subscribed please make sure you hit the subscribe button and the little bell button because the little bell is a notification it will send you every time I upload a new video so you can make sure that you watch all of my amazing videos and um, so another goal of mine is to upload three days per week so I have been uploading three to four days a week but I'm going to be consistent and say three days a week is what I'm going to upload and in a year that is 156 videos so i think that's pretty good i mean that's a massive chunk of my time making editing uploading sharing promoting all that sort of stuff um so 156 videos per year is the goal three days per week and i think that's pretty good um one blog post a week is what i'm going to be doing and um, sometimes they will like coincide with a video and um, if i'm kind of doing like a haul and i'm going to include links like amazon links and that sort of stuff and um, but sometimes um probably most times it's going to be different content to what i'm sharing on my channel and um, so make sure that you check out my blog it's oririshfamily.com and um, I have that also linked below in the description for you to check out. Um, one collab per month on YouTube. So it's going to be 12 collabs. Um, it's what one channel like so like last month I did one with Vin Vanilla and Canilla. I've done some with Simon McSo, Lindsay Life and Style, Jessica Davis, Miss Davis, um, The Mama Lounge, like you know one collab per month is my goal and that just gets you introduced to new channels that you may not already know and it also introduces me to their subscribers and it's just kind of a way for us creators to promote ourselves and other people's channels um then i want to do new logo and channel art and that's going to be for my blog and my youtube um, and also i've been kind of tying with whether or not i should do like an intro into my videos let me know in the comments what you think whether or not i should do an intro but guys that really are my my goals for this month for this year um i don't know if you've noticed but youtube now have a community tab um and you may have seen like little polls and pictures or like little texts come up on your feed from me. And um, so that is how I'm going to try and gauge what content I want to upload. I will include like a little video here of my community tab. Make sure that you go check that out. If it's not appearing on your feed, you can vote for it. I'm asking whether you want to have two um cleaning videos per month whether you want a cleaning or declutter what sort of videos you want to see throughout the month of january february and um, so there'll be ongoing polls there about stuff i'm kind of like thinking about and whether my subscribers will be interested in that sort of content so the youtube community tab um make sure you check out that and keep up to date and interact with me there and basically it's you know that's going to help me make content that you are wanting to see and um, i also have a facebook and instagram and twitter i'll have them all linked below my facebook um i will have both my blog posts and my um youtube videos every time i upload one of them every day i upload something there i also upload like if i see cool cooking videos that i think might be interested or that sort of parenting type um, videos or stories from other channels, I share that on my channel as well. So it's not just content about me and my channel, um, it's content that I think is interesting from other people's channels as well. Um, then my Instagram, I share pictures of Ava, I do Insta stories, um, so it'll give you like a little clip of what's happening throughout the day, um, that sort of stuff. And then my Twitter, my Twitter is kind of like, I'm kind of only grasping what to do with Twitter. And um, Twitter has always just flown over my head. I've had it for years, but I've barely used it. So this year, I also want to learn how and what to share on Twitter. <laughs> um, 
so yeah and my blog as i said i have a blog i'm going to be doing a blog post every week it's most of the time it's going to be different from the content i shared here so or irishfamily.com if you want to check that out i will have all of those links to all my social media and everything i mentioned down in the description so make sure you click on that little down arrow and you can find out all that information of everything i've described today i really really hope that you've enjoyed this video let me know down below if you set yourself any goals or new year's resolutions I'd love to read what you are wanting to achieve this year. Um, so yeah, that is it guys. I hope you enjoy it. Please give this video a thumbs up if you've had. Subscribe if you are new and hit that little bell button because it lets you know every single time I upload a new video. And that's it. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.